Hello everyone, this is the uh, rear distribution box, power distribution box of BMW 3 Series F30 model. You can see it is designated as Z2 and uh, um, here to check the fuel pump supply. As you can see, uh, the, the rear distribution box, power distribution box is located just behind the seats uh, next to the battery as shown in the figure uh, this is the functional diagram from which we can start the fuel injection circuit system so this is the fuse box coming from the battery you can see it is a 100 amps uh, fuse and it directly go to uh, the rear fuse box z2 12b that's uh, connection and it should have a uh, full uh, like full time it should be on it should be positive then the second one going to the fuse box uh, is from the front electronics module you can see that uh, it's from the a173 uh, 4b connector and the pin number is 5 now it should also be uh, full time uh, positive coming without uh, plugging in the key so this is the relay and it goes to fuse number 165 which is again located in the same fuse box z2 which is in the rear side uh or the trunk whatever you call it let me see where is the fuse box just to show you so this is z 28 b uh this one the fifth uh, connection should be positive always and uh, when you disconnect it from the real then let me see okay this is the location where uh, the fuse box rear fuse box is really uh, located it's in the right side you can see as I have demonstrated here let me see if I can find it yeah this will make it much more clear all right and uh, this is the Z 11 b connector this one so uh, one connector is z 28 b uh, where is it just need to keep all the tabs uh, in order so that you don't get confused all right see okay z 28 b and z 12 b uh, Z28B uh, pin number 5 and Z212B pin number 1 you can just go through this and find out if it is having a positive voltage coming in uh, so that we can make sure the fuse box uh, on the battery terminal is not blown out if this one is not giving a full voltage then you need to check the fuse on the f on the battery fuse box or uh, if the current is not coming from the friend uh, electronic module you need to go to the front electronics module and dive in deep over there and uh, you can see everything you check is from the rear uh, fuse box z28b connector number five uh, no the pin number five and z212 b the pin number one all right just check it and uh, i'll show you what it leads to so it goes to fuse number 165 which is a uh, 20 amps which directly goes to the fuel pump control unit from the fuel pump control unit it goes to the fuel pump 
I'll show you where the fuel pump control unit is located um, in just a second yeah this is the fuel pump control unit you can see the rear side seat uh, left side it's shown in just behind the seat so you might have to rip it open there might be a clip or uh, screws I'm not sure I don't have this car so so here you can see a 98 is the uh, fuel pump control unit and a 98 1b is the connector and a 98 2b is another connector and let me go back to the fuel pump yeah this is the fuel pump uh, sorry this is the fuel pump uh, control unit you can see from fuse number 165 which is located on the rear side of fuse of the car uh, from z211 b it comes directly to pin number one of the fuel pump control unit connector a 98 one b which directly goes to the electric fuel pump depending on the type of the pump that you have one is with a sensor something like that ethanol sensor and one with without ethanol sensor but the scheme the schematic diagram will be the same so you just have to make sure there is power till this part uh, so it's better to start from the rear power distribution box which will make us easy to find out where the problem starts from right so just go through this first and if there is any confusion just let me know here you can see uh, the connector z to 12b which is directly coming from the battery uh, just make sure there is supply in it the, and problem the other can one also be z to 8b uh, you can the DME, see i have highlighted the, the uh, fuel connection pump number five to turn on the yellow fuel pump in order to uh, you do have the, uh, to make sure processes. this one is but also is having a supply that voltage all the time see if in it's order working to or not. power up the fuel pump uh, i hope if everyone these two will be are checking okay the fuse then first. there is something problem After with the fuel the fuse, pump or go to the fuel pump control in unit to find out if uh, the supply is there or not uh, there can be the fuse uh, which is incorporated on the battery is uh, integrated so it's a little bit difficult to take it out and uh, replace it you have to replace the entire unit or try to rip it apart and uh, put another fuse you fuse uh, in somehow by soldering or something like that i have done that before for the uh, glow pump compartment fuel box which is uh, located in the front part of the car but not on this one uh, on x5 but uh, uh, this one i'm not sure about that so you have to try if the supply is not there thank you